Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a really exciting video for you guys. And if you haven't read the title of the video, I'll be doing a first impressions on da 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 the highly coveted Wet n Wild Mega Glow Summer 2016 highlighters. Everybody and their moms are trying to get their hands on this highlighter. Um I tried looking in stores for it, everywhere sold out by me, and when Wet n Wild said that they were restocking on their website, and I went last week, oh lord, lord, <laughs> you, that site kept glitching so bad, and it said it was sold out, but then it went live again, and I managed to get my hand on these and a few more. Um, if you're interested in hearing my thoughts and my first impressions on this highlighter, please keep on watching as well as like and subscribe to my channel. And then if you are not, please stop right here. It's not worth your time and effort. And let's get into the video. What that noise is in the background, that whirring noise, it's hot. It's super hot and my fan's going, so pardon the noise. So like I said before, the highlighters, everybody is looking for them, like everybody wants their hands on them. There are two colors, this one which is like this rose gold shade with a little bit of copper, it's called Crown of My Canopy, and then this shade right here which is kind of like this like peachy beige color, it's called Precious Petals. Precious Petals is the more popular one out of the two, but people, if they can get their hands on Crown of My Canopy, they are. Um, these retail for $3.99 each. I purchased mine off of the Wet n Wild website when they restocked. We've been kind of having sporadic restocks lately, um, and their site has been crashing really, really bad, so that's how I managed to get them. When they were available in stores, there were only like two or three of each color in the display and it was kind of sent as a promotional item by Wet n Wild to drugstores, so that's why it sold out so quickly in stores. I am wearing Precious Petals on my cheeks today. If you would like to see like my actual reaction when I'm like first applying on my face, please go to my last video which is my tutorial on this makeup look there you'll see like my first reaction like putting it on for the first time it's pretty eventful and magical but yeah um yeah so those are the two colors they blend really easily the texture is this is like quality of a high-end highlighter like it's it's great like at the highlight like it's it's so pretty and the texture is great it's blendable um super duper pigmented you can build it up um yeah the only thing that when i'm looking at this is that the colors even though everyone's crazy about them it's just that we've seen these colors before so i went digging in my collection and Lo and behold, they're dupes of Becca Opal and Becca Rose Gold. I will swatch them side by side so you can see. Here is what the first two look like. Right here is Opal by Becca and then here is Precious Petals. Um, looking at it, Opal is more yellow. It's definitely more yellow, but they still have that same beige undertone. Precious Petals is definitely more peach with gold in there. And yeah, so they look very similar when they're applied onto the skin. Um, blended out, but like when they're like heavy swatches are done, they're actually quite different. You really don't want to spend the money to buy the Becca highlighters and you're looking for these. These are actually a really great alternative. The only thing that sucks is that they're limited edition, which just really annoys me. 
because White Wild needs to make this permanent. They need to come up with more colors and make these permanent. So that those are Opal and Precious Petals. And now I'm going to compare Crown of My Canopy and Becca Rose Gold. Just looking at them in the pan, um, Crown of My Canopy definitely has more warmth to it. Rose Gold seems more cool, but they still have that same undertone of like that rosy kind of color. Um, so now I'm gonna swatch them for you guys. Okay. So up on top is Crown of My Canopy and then down below is Rose Gold. Um, Crown of My Canopy is definitely has more like warm and bronze to it. Um, rose gold is more of a dusty kind of pink. They look remarkably similar. It's just that one is warm, one one is warmer, and one is cooler. So I mean, you don't need both, but they're really, really pretty. Like each of them on their own, they're really pretty. But man, these wet and wild highlighters are amazing overall i would give these a 10 out of 10 i understand the hype on why everybody wants them uh definitely i think wet and mild should come out with more colors perhaps like a bronze like a really deep bronze kind of color or like a very very light white gold or a white silver color to cater to like all different skin tones because they nailed it with these they really did and i feel like they can really take their brand to the next level if they make more of these in different colors um but yeah that's what i think of them i think they're awesome i think they're great definitely have to play with them a bit more to really get my opinion down if i like truly like them a lot but definitely a 10 out of 10 for my first impressions guys enjoyed the first impressions video what and wild needs to make this permanent they really need to make it permanent <laughs> they have no idea how far they can go if they really just like add more colors to the range and make these permanent that would be awesome um but yeah like these were definitely like a win a win a great pass I don't know how else to describe it. Please let me know what you guys would like to see on my channel in the comments down below. If you guys want to see more tutorials, more um, more tutorials, more demos, more reviews, more first impressions, let me know what you guys want to see. Um, thank you all for watching and I hope you have a wonderful day wherever you are and I will see you guys later. Bye guys.